Hey, Warpugs. So, last time we saw Rubik's Raptor in this particular series that he's doing, he was basically summoning tanks that were getting launched into the suborbital trajectories by jeeps. Now, now that was Unrelenting Chaos against Innocent Stormtroopers. So, if you haven't seen that yet, go check that out. Link will be in the description below as well as my reaction to it. But, today, we're going to be checking out Being Massacred by an Insane Jedi. And this... This... This stands to reason that it's going to be messed up. So, are you ready? I'm ready. Good times rhymes with war crimes. And I just need another tank to be launched at the speed of sound away from a position. I just want to see it. So, without anything else being said, let's get into it. Howdy! In the last part, I exploded a bunch. And that doesn't really get better in this part, but at the very least, it makes a lot more sense considering this is the latter half of the operation, which hmm. will be a lot more combat heavy. Also, okay. I'm going to bore you again with explaining the operation twice. I'll just have part one linked at the top of the description for those interested, uh, though there is a specific situation that probably deserves more context, just because okay. you have to derive it from a jumble of radio communications that really don't do it justice for it, because I find the entire situation hilarious. So okay. essentially what happened is there was a rebel disguised as, quote, the Grand Admiral who showed up at the Dola <laughs> checkpoint in the north. Uh, unknown to this rebel is that his other rebel colleagues at the same time were doing the same exact bit at the other two checkpoints in the area. All of them claiming to be an Imperial Admiral. It was going fine for them until the disguised Admiral at the Mian checkpoint got in a tragic car accident, while at the same time the platoon leader for the Dola checkpoint talked on long range about the Admiral being at their checkpoint. This started a conversation between all the platoon leaders that resulted in just an awful massacre uh, that will be in this video. Okay. But I hope this provides enough context that when you get to that part in the video, it makes a lot more sense. Uh, that pretty much does it for the intro. I hope you enjoy the video, obviously, and I will see you around. Have Let's go. One. Let's go. Ignis Corps. Command Rancor, we've been engaged by one time Jedi on different checkpoints. You guys are fine. The ambulance crashed into one of our parked vehicles and exploded. Oh, oh no! <laughs> my oh my god. Eric, everybody. <laughs> Not a Jedi cipher. Um, Jedi has reduced different checkpoints to one third strength. Had no choice but to eliminate Jedi. <laughs> you really? Jump so high, command. Got one on the ridge to the right. Nice. I got shot. Nice. All using the goddamn walls as actual cover. I hate this. Hey, uh, you <laughs> have a trooper that's force sensitive. Uh, you're gonna have to it really explain really that. <laughs> 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 Oh my god, play Duel of the Fates now! Yes! Because Duel of Fates is copyright, so I have to make my own. They're just rolling. Star Wars Dark Souls Edition. Star Wars Dark Souls Edition. Yep. Oh my god. You finally got him. Finally. Oh my god, he's so slippery. I see him dead in the gully. There's only one thing you have to do now. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> you are resistant. How? Excuse me? Sh should I fight back? I, I oh, oh, you have a force shield up because you have oh, a Oh, oh my god, really? <laughs> I'm going to, uh, cheat. <laughs> Jay uses the powers of a god. Oh, and if anybody was wondering if the hospital is doing okay, I told you guys what was happening a little while ago. She's just in here watching me very judgmentally right now. Very judgmentally. She's just... Uh, I had to take her to the hospital because um, um, she is the only person that I know that can fall walking off mostly flat terrain. And she wound up really messing up her ankle. And now she's got on a boot. And she's got a cane that she's walking around with right now. She's staring at me very judgmentally. She's being quiet, though. Hi. She's being very quiet. But judgmental. Grand Hall. Uh, sorry, Grand Hall. Uh, do we 
have any certifications for this man. Well, I can come by and take a take a gander. Okay. Oh, is this the guy? Uh, okay, so yeah, we were expecting you actually. <laughs> <laughs> became an artillery shell. Lovely. Somebody who's posing as an investigator as the Grand Admiral. Uh huh. Copy that. It's a fake. It's a fake. How do you know I am a fake? fake. You can't. Tell oh, me so the Wing Cipher was in this. Nice. Please tell me he has something up. I'd love to see his his thing through this. Please tell me he has one up. If it's you, you dare. You. She stares very judgmentally at me from the corner. Do not bonk me. D stop, stop, stop. Abuse, abuse. You dare question me? Oh. <laughs> oh my god, he's not an admiral at all. No, he's not an admiral at all. Run. Run, Jay. He's dead. We fire from armored, uh, from heavy weaponry from the south hill. Oh shit! Oh lord! You try to get them to cover. I think they've been almost entirely wiped out. They ain't making it. Nice All firing right, line. I approve the firing line. Uh, unfortunately, the rebels have taken control of the planet spaceport. There is currently a Jedi getting an orbital ready transport. Audible goblin energy. Him before he can leave. This is Rancor. I from we are, we're putting plans down on the map now. Okay. A firm, please make sure they're in statue. So a firm. This is a lot of boys. Yeah. Yeah. I'll add it to my collection. If I go missing, you all know why. Knock it off. This is abuse. Ow. <laughs> no, it's I Fighter. Nice. Go, go. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Get it. Really? Why did you swerve? Hit him! Ah! Oh no! <laughs> hey, I'm out of control. It's upside down. Tragic. Yeah, it's very tragic. Ooh. <laughs> They're, they're making it He's work. Right what is he? He just... Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Is, is Tiger okay? No, he's not okay. He's just it's sleeping. Fine. He's sleeping. It's not in here, right? I have a man on top of me. Oh That's my covered. god. A lot of help that oh, Star Destroyer is doing. Yes, that's gone. <laughs> Let's go, Uga. Command, this is Rancor. Hospitalize on the jet. 
And they still have another one of those to deal with. That's lovely. What the? How did both of you die? There's a man on a quad bike. They're behind us. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, good, good, good on you. Uh, He's just trucking it in there. Yeah, I'd say the hangers. Oh, or just inside. Okay. One of us was not like the others. Hey, uh, that's a fuck. They got him! Nice! What? Uh oh. <laughs> For hey! One, shoot someone on my own side at the mission complete screen! Nice! Nice! Imagine just for a second that you have those type of physics in real life. I would never want to be just driving along and a little bunny runs out in the middle of the road and all of a sudden I'm like entering space because that's what happens here. The physics engine in this is the best part of this game. Like legitimately that, that vehicle hit the concrete barrier then bounced around like it was inside of a ping pong. Like it was literally inside of a pinball machine for 30 seconds until it blew up and then it flew away. Guys, Rubik's Raptor. Um... And Ignis Tour. I really, I really would like to see Soloing Cipher's uh, view of this. I really would like to see that. Um, guys, 100%. Just uh, thank you for uh, checking this out with me. Um, if you want to check out anything from Rubik's Raptor, just check the links down below. I'm going to have all this, uh, all the links in the description, including the first part of this video if you haven't seen that yet. So go check that out. Aside from all that, hit the like button. If you haven't already. And I've seen how many of you have subscribed to me or not. She's she's glaring at me. Just glaring. I'm not. She is glaring at me. I'm not. You should see her just standing in the corner like a gremlin. I'm gonna whack you for real with this stick in a second. This is called abuse. <laughs> she hates. Stop it. Stop. Stop. I'm trying to wrap up here. I got very important things to do. <laughs> well, get on with it. I have a Patreon down below so I can buy her flowers next month. <laughs> next <laughs> month. <laughs> <laughs> and guys, um, yeah. Uh, I think that's about it. Whatever you guys do today... Be sure to do something for yourself. Enjoy yourselves. And, uh, yeah. I'll catch you guys next time. Um, this weekend, um, Sunday, we are playing Amoogus. So join us for that. And uh, I'm going to be working on two separate videos again. Scripting again. All that other kind of good stuff again. I'm an idiot. We know this. I'll catch you guys next time. Imagine the amount that we could save on space vehicles if we just figured out how to make the physics in real life work like Armor 3. We could just hit things with a hammer and they fly directly to the International Space Station. It would work, guys. It would work. <laughs>